Hi. Good morning. They're nice. <laughs> Little banana for breakfast. What's up, beautiful people? It's been a very, very good last morning here in Minka. A macaw came to visit, and we've just seen two incredible keel build toucans. Wow. Absolutely unreal and we think they're still kind of hanging around in the trees nearby so fingers crossed we'll be able to see some more but also this little guy has just come out to play. Yesterday we saw some of the local kids actually manage to uh, get this macaw, we think it's the same one, on their arm and then on a branch and then they walked off with it. Cheese! Oh. Oh. <laughs> so uh, Hannah and I are tentatively considering uh, trying to get it on our arms. You're going to give it a go? Uh, I want to watch you give it a go. <laughs> Hello. Uh oh. Um, no. Lawrence has found a branch. This is the way forward I think. No, don't eat the branch. No, don't, don't. Oh. Step on it. Yes. Oh, 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 we have a macaw. Yes, we have a macaw. <laughs> Hello. No, we have a macaw. Hello. What? <laughs> Is it painful? No, it's fine. Oh. Do you want to give it a go? No. I thought you wanted to hold it. No, I'm actually quite okay. Lance is now taking a selfie with the parrot. Weird interactions of the day. Ah. Mm. He likes him. Got a new friend for breakfast, Alex. Oh! Oh, oh. oh God! Bye, bye, McCall. What a good morning it's been. We've seen the toucans held a macaw that was kind of crazy and now we're very late for uh, the time we're meant to be leaving we're very late for the time we're meant to be leaving for Cartagena but very worth it so pretty this place highly highly recommended for a delicious breakfast in Minka bye guys Muchas gracias por todo. Ciao. <laughs> Cannot recommend that place enough. If you're in Minka, chill out hostel. That is the place to be. Oh, there's aircon. Aircon? Aircon. Thank God. Oh. Perfecto. Okay. Perfecto. Uh. minibus to Barranquilla which is like the next city along the coast from Santa Marta where we are now and from there we can go on to Cartagena. I 
lived in Balenquia, cost us about £5.50, 24,000 pesos to get here and now we've got to swap buses, pay the same again and do apparently another two hour journey to Cartagena but the two hour journey to Balenquia took four hours so we'll see. Cartagena, we have arrived. Not ideal, the hostel that we had booked into had somehow lost our reservation or something like that. They made it work, they've held our luggage, but we've got to spend our first night out of three here at a different place. So we're just wandering through the streets trying to find that right now. But at least we have somewhere to sleep, so there's that. Yes. Not quite how we expected our first night in Cartena to be, but we've got a room, it's somewhere to sleep for the night, and uh, what we've got to see of Cartagena so far, like all the colonial buildings and architecture, it's pretty cool. Definitely, definitely feels a lot more European. Definitely a very different feel to anywhere else we've been in Colombia so far from what little we've seen and I'm excited to see a little bit more once we've got everything else sorted tomorrow but a little bit of a travel day feels like a lifetime ago since I was holding the parrot this morning but I'm gonna finish this one up here thank you so much for watching big love feels good around here